live, local, late breaking. This is KEZI 9 News at 4. Hospital shelves are struggling to stay stocked as the country sees yet another shortage, this time a shortage of blood donations. Thank you for joining us this afternoon. I'm Ariel Yakabazi. KEZI 9 News reporter Jennifer Singh has more on how much blood our community has lost. As of today, the American Red Cross has seen a shortfall of about 25,000 blood donations just over the first two months of summer. And with each blood donation having the capacity to save up to three lives, that's as many as 75,000 people who are not getting the care they need. What we typically see going into the summer months is a drop in our donations. Um, this is because people are going on summer vacation and they're just busy out doing summer things and not really thinking about coming in and donating blood. The Red Cross says with the shortage, it is hard to keep hospital shelves stocked with blood products needed to save lives. Our blood supply or the need for blood doesn't take a summer vacation. Um, you're always going to have patients um, that are going to need that life-saving blood. Officials say the only way to keep up with the consistent need for blood is by donations. Bloodworks Northwest, a community-based blood center with locations in Lane County, says they're always looking for people to donate, and it only takes an hour. Bloodworks has a mission to meet this need, this blood supply need, right? And it's a mission that we're never going to actually achieve, right? We are always going to be in that need. Donation centers are most in need of type O blood types. And the Red Cross also needs type A and B negative blood donors, as well as platelet donors. Red Cross is also offering an incentive. You can donate throughout the month of August and get a $10 e-gift card to a movie merchant of your choice. But ultimately, Donation centers say the greatest reward is saving lives through donations. I think the greatest benefit um, to donating blood is being able to save a life. Um, I don't think it gets much better than that. The need for blood donations is critical, but blood donation centers are optimistic as new FDA regulations continue to be implemented across the country. Coming up on KEZI 9 News at 5, how the new FDA regulations allow for more potential donors, regardless of gender or sexual orientation. Reporting in Eugene, Jennifer Singh, KEZI 9 News.